Former Norwich Sports Information Director Charlie Crosby lost his 15-year battle with leukemia last Friday night. He was 75 years old. We profiled Charlie in his fight with the disease about two and a half years ago. We called that story a heart of maroon and gold. Today, a community is heartbroken. Scott Fleshman has more. An emptiness has overtaken the Norwich Athletics Department. It can be felt in the rink, on the fields, and throughout the offices. People remember him walking around here being uh, vibrant and, and energized. Charlie Crosby wasn't just an alumni, class of 63, and he wasn't your average school employee. In fact, Charlie was many things to many people, a mentor. I owe it all to him. He took a chance on me and believed in me and what I could do and what he thought I might like here at Norwich. A fan. He would know individual players on my team and would specifically ask, how is this player doing? A critic. And I remember some certain times him coming in the office and saying, like, Mark, you guys stink. <laughs> and, uh... You know, and, and really being able to take that for, for nothing more than him wanting to see us get better. But to all, he was a friend. If he saw someone in need, he would secretly make sure they got taken care of. He would tell people straight out, like, you know, this this is what I'm this is what I'm dealing with, and you know, I think he said it in the he said it in the story he did. You know, I, I kind of like think of cancer as my, my friend. friend. You know, I mean, I, it's been around with me for 12 years. Yeah. It's not going to leave. It's going to stick with me. Crosby officially retired last May after serving 10 years in the sports information office. He got to see his granddaughter go through college at Norwich and was able to move his wife Carol into a home in Maine. It seemed like after that he finally was able to give in and he he's not suffering anymore well, obviously we're in the, the business of competition and Charlie was competing against an opponent that is a difficult one to face and yet he faced it with courage and with grace Charlie was such a big part of who Norwich is and who what Norwich Athletics is all about. He just really wanted to be back here. He really loved the institution and to be able to interact with coaches and student athletes on a regular basis was, you know, it's it's like, uh, you know, he hit the jackpot. And uh, I think that's what he's going to be remembered by. Charlie was honored with a moment of silence before last Saturday's Norwich men's lacrosse game. However, a more formal memorial service for Charlie Crosby will take place here on campus Saturday, May 21st at 11 a.m. In Northfield, Scott Fleischman, Channel 3 Sports. Well, truly yeah. the heart of that athletic family and, uh, you know, known him for, for a long time, all the time that I've been here, that he's been, in, you know, a part of that as well. And, uh, you know, we just, uh, our thoughts are with that entire community um, moving forward.